let's go find ourselves some UV centers. So right off the bat, you're going to want to have a blend file or an FBX or some kind of model file that you can work off of and import into Blender. Uh, so get that loaded and make sure you can actually see your mesh and you can move around and stuff. Uh, to move around, I'm using middle mouse and also shift plus middle mouse to drag around. Uh, so first things first, we're going to need to find the object on which the eyes are stored. So for the Wicker Beast, it's pretty simple. We only have an armature and a body on that armature. I know the body has the eyes on them, so we're going to work with the body object today. We're going to want to go into edit mode by pressing control tab and then selecting edit mode over here. Make sure to unselect any vertices by just clicking off to the side here. And we're going to be looking for these two dots on the eyes. So go into UV editing tab over here at the top. Now press this. It's like two arrow, like this button that has like two arrows over here on the top left. You're going to want to click that. You're going to see this giant spaghetti mess of, of vertices and dots. Uh, we're going to want to ignore that. And uh, we're going to need to find the UV centers using this. It's not that scary. So we're going to first of all find the left eye centers. So looking from the character's perspective, this is their left eye. So if we were to be in the character's head, that would be their left eye, right? So we're going to left eye. Also, you can turn these bones off by uh, get out of here. All right. So click on the left eye center vertex. And if you have this option turned on, you're going to see it highlight over here. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to grab, um, I want to find There we go. This little stupid arrow over here to the side, I had to Roll off to the side. You're gonna want to find the stupid little tiny arrow off the side here. I want to click on it and drag it. Make sure you grab the arrow and not the side panel. Grab the arrow, drag it out. I'm gonna have this side panel over here. And what you're gonna want to do again, make sure you've got the vertex selected. You're gonna want to navigate to UV vertex and open this up. And this is gonna give you the UV centers. So we are going to select the eye. Drag this out and click on U vertex. And now we're going to copy these into our left eye X and left eye Y. And now we have the set up. Again, repeat the same process for the right eye now. Select the vertex and copy values. Now, in case you want to share this with me uh, on Twitter or on Discord in DMs uh, so that I can add it into the list of presets, um, please, 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 please copy these values as text and paste them to me uh, in text and don't just take a screenshot of them. Um, Unity might hide some of the uh, decimal points. And so I want to... You have to be as precise as possible with these. So please make sure you get all the digits. Thank you. Um, and of course... You're not quite done with your setup yet in case you have a texture like this just kind of hanging out off to the side. Uh, this is because of an overlay texture on the 1D or polar or um, overlay texture here or parallax over here. Um, and the parallax uh, material. And we have a video showcasing how to set that up. It's in the description. Uh, it's not that bad. Go take a look. Yeah, that's about it.